Oh, so the video gonna be about the George Foreman thing that it's like they coming out now saying the sixties and the seventies, two women now saying that they was touched up by George. And I don't know why, you know, it's fashionable to go after him now. But you wouldn't think about it. You're a black man, your sexuality in America with three Ks, they gonna stick at you no matter what. George Foreman denies it. And I wonder why all this time, we're talking half a century ago now. But see, that's what happened when you're black. They're always going to find a way to dig it up. Always going to find a way to dig it up. And always try to come at you with it. And I don't know, you know, why. Because it's going to be about money. It wasn't about no justice. And then you got to kind of wonder, you know, how does this kind of, the era of the Foreman Grills, the era of his championships, the era of him coming back 25 years ago. He came back and uh, won the belt, one of the oldest champions ever. And now they want to regurgitate this and throw this back at him. You got to kind of wonder what's the agenda. Who is he ticked off now? Because it makes you wonder why are they bringing this back again? And what's the purpose of this? The George Foreman, you know, machine, they're coming back at it again. What's the purpose? What's the reason? It just got you shaking your head. And, um, you know, George Foreman in his older years now definitely don't need to be going through this crap. Definitely not. But this is what happens. People want to selectively regurgitate what they want. Selectively, you know, about this. And it's just an evil oddity out here. Please hit like, subscribe, work on thoughts and comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And it just ain't good. They need to leave George Foreman alone. I'm out.